hello guys welcome to solving solutions your number one channel where you get solutions to all your solving problems it's nice having you in class again today how have you been on today's tutorial we are going to show you how to convert this um, data set that the data type is actually a float into an integer right good so we are having a digital elevation model whose data type is in float so there are some analysis that you want to carry out that um, would require your raster data to be an integer data type right good so we are actually using a digital elevation model for today's demonstration so it can be any raster so let's come to raster and then from raster we go to conversion right good then under conversion we go to translate so you can see it converts what format now under the translate which is the convert format window we have the input which is our digital elevation model so if you also want to override the projection for the output file you can do that but that's of little interest to us we are only interested in what the output data type right good however if you go through the different parameters and then you find something interesting you can actually add it up so for the output data type we have the use layer data type which is not what we want so when we click on it we have um, other options to select from so we have the integer 16 which is um, similar to what we need integer 32 they are actually what integer data types right good different bytes with which the integer values are stored so let's go with the 16 so having fixed that you can decide to save your converted file into your converted data into a file or as a temporary file so on today's demonstration we are going to leave it as a temporary file and then we run so we can see that um, the tool has run successfully and then we have the converted right good so if we open it up up to the data type you can now see what integer 16 right good so 16 bit signed integer unlike um, the original data that we have 32 bit floating point right good so we have shown you on today's tutorial how you can convert your data type which is in float to what to integer using um, QGIS so we are going to see you on the next tutorial ensure you keep staying safe and have a fantastic time bye